I'm James Ennis, Artistic Director of the Seattle Chamber Music Society, and it's my great pleasure to welcome you to our beautiful new Center for Chamber Music. We are now in the Diana K. Carey Gallery, recognizing one of the many generous donors, as well as one of our co-chairs for the $5 million capital campaign. This inviting space will serve as the audience entrance to our home and will feature a rotating gallery. The James F. Rourke Jr. MD Lobby is a space to get comfortable and chat with friends, have a glass of wine, and enjoy yourself before an event here at the center. It is also home to the donor wall, recognizing all gifts of $5,000 or more. With your help, we have reached our $5 million goal that built this beautiful space and increased our endowment. I'm currently standing in the performance hub of the center, the Dr. Kenan Hollingsworth Living Room. We've been filming performances for our 2020 Summer Festival for the last several weeks from this beautiful space. It's a wonderful place for performing and will make a wonderful home for music for the many, many years to come. On the back wall is the Toby Sachs Chamber Music Library, a wonderful resource that we musicians have been using just about every day. We had the great fortune of creating this space completely from scratch, a studs out remodel and that gave us the opportunity to create a room that was not only acoustically beautiful, but also technologically state-of-the-art. This wonderful room will be home in the future to many exciting events like master classes, lectures, lecture recitals, chamber music performances, films on music, and so much more. We're now entering the Patricia Tal Takash and Gary Takash rehearsal room. This is one of the most beautiful spaces in the building, with beautiful light coming in from both 6th Avenue as well as Union Street. Gary and Patricia are not just wonderful sponsors of SCMS, but Patricia was one of our co-chairs for the $5 million capital campaign. This is the James Ennis rehearsal room, a gift from James A. Penny and Laura Lee Young. I'm tremendously honored to have my name attached to this, and it's particularly special for me as it was a gift from two such wonderful friends. Continuing along the corridor, we enter the administrative side of the building. This part of the center hosts our administrative offices as well as our box office. It is a great joy to finally have our musicians and our administrators in the same place. This beautiful facility has enabled us to keep the music going during this challenging time, and we can't wait to welcome you all to this center in person before too long.